Okay, first set's gonna be Laundry and Games Room. We'll start off in B and Games Room. Go ahead and reinforce this wall to the left. Put Tremere down on it. And now you can watch this uh, eastern hallway. You can open up this wall to cut off any rotates for the enemy team. And it'll give you a good line of sight. Use your second reinforcement on this easternmost wall over here. And go ahead and open up the rest of this wall. I'll explain why once we get over to the A site. Use your third and fourth reinforcements on this western wall over here. Okay, now in A, laundry room. Go ahead and reinforce this left side wall on the eastern side. Put your mirror on top of it. This way you'll be able to watch the stairs, as well as the door over there, and then all of B, in case the person on the B mirror dies. This way you only have to put one person into B, and then you have the rest of the people playing in A. As well as the shower over here. I do recommend having one person roam over here as we're going to reinforce these walls. Go ahead and use your 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th, and 10th reinforcements on these walls over here. Something to keep in mind is that most of these floors are destructible, so a buck or a Sophia or something can get you. Just keep that in mind, you might want to have a roamer downstairs. Alrighty, for party room slash office, let's get started. Go ahead and reinforce these two walls over here on the southern side. We're not going to have anyone really be playing in B since it's so open to attack. From both these windows and the side hall over here. Go ahead and reinforce the right side of the party room wall. Put your mirror on top. And now you can watch anyone coming into B from the garage side or from this hallway over here as well. Okay, so go ahead and reinforce this left wall here. The second wall as well. And then go ahead and reinforce this third wall. And put your mirror on top. This way you're able to watch the window and the west side push. You can use your 7th and 8th reinforcements on these two walls if you'd like. Or you can shoot out the bottom and cut rotate off from people coming through here. It's up to you. For your last two reinforcements, you can go ahead and reinforce the outside of the garage to slow down the push. Here and here. Alright, for first floor nature room and bush ranger room, go ahead and use your first four reinforcements on this western wall over here. You can commit to somebody roaming the stairs as well as this hallway. Putting a mirror on here is not going to be much use to you. Go ahead and come into B over here. Use your fifth and sixth reinforcement on this eastern wall. And we're going to go ahead and place a soft mirror on this single uh, wall over here. This cuts off rotate into iguana room as well as green over here. And also if they overtake this and jump in, you are able to defend yourself before they rush in. So it's a bit safer than placing your mirror on this green wall over here. Your second mirror is going to go in between connector here, place it on the right side. Go ahead and open up this wall. This way you're able to hold the door open. And you can also peek through and get this wall if they thermite it open. Alternatively, you can have someone with an ACOG peeking behind the bomb here. It's a pretty safe spot since it's hard to get your head. Just be careful if there's someone playing that mirror so they don't dome you. It's 
really up to you where you want to put your last three reinforcements. You can put them into the kitchen to slow down their entry. Just be careful of the ceiling as it's all destructible. So if a fuser above gets up there, you can be in serious trouble. Alright, for compressor and gear store room, you're actually going to play this site very similar to how you'd play penthouse on coastline. So you're going to go ahead and reinforce this left side wall in the compressor room. Put your mirror on. You put your second mirror on a soft wall on the right side. I like to put it towards the left, that way you can shoot out this right side and you can do a quick beat. You can also open up the top of this left wall to throw your C4s through. Go ahead and use your second, third, and fourth reinforcements on this B side over here. Use your 5th, 6th, 7th, and 8th reinforcements on the A side. And it's up to you where you want to put your last two. You can either put it into here so they can't go through kitchen easily. Or you can again put it into garage. Again, watch out for up top like all the other sites as they can shoot right through you. 